Hello dear students this is Miss Sonika from Deepal School today i'm going to teach the second chapter of english literature of class 7 that is swami and the sum written by r k narayan rasipuram krishna swami narayana swami 1906 to 2001 is best known for his story set in the fictional town of malgudi His writing career spanning 60 years, the Sahitya Academy in 1958 for the guide was his first major award. He was awarded the Padma Bhushan in 1964 and the Padma Vibhushan, India's second highest civilian honor, in 2001. In the story Swami and the Sum A young boy named Swaminathan is attempting to solve a problem from an arithmetic book. His father reads out to him that someone named Rama has 10 mangoes with which he wants to earn 15 annas. Krishna wants only 4 mangoes. How much will Krishna have to pay? Let's read on the story to find out whether Swami was able to solve the sum or not. Swami Nathan has been enjoying his summer vacations by going out to play every afternoon. One day his father catches him just as he is about to leave. He then orders Swami to bring his books into his room. So every afternoon Swami Nathan was enjoying his summer vacations. And one day what happened his father caught him when he was about to leave to go out and play. then his father ordered him to bring his books into his room half an hour later swami nathan sat in his father's room with a slate in his hand and pencil ready father held the arithmetic book open and dictated rama has 10 mangoes with which he wants to earn 15 annas here annas refers to in early times a rupee considered consisted of 16 annas krishna wants only 4 mangoes how much will krishna have to pay so after half an hour swami nathan came to his father's room with a slate in his hand and a pencil then father started to dictate a sum from his arithmetic book which stated that Rama has 10 mangoes with which he wants to earn 15 nanas. Krishna wants only 4 mangoes. How much will Krishna have to pay? Swami Nathan gazed and gazed at this sum and every time he read it it seemed to acquire a new meaning. He had the feeling of having stepped into a fearful maze. Maze here is a complicated system of paths where one can easily get lost so Sw- swami nathan started to look at a, at the sum every time he is reading the sum he gets a new meaning his mouth began to water at the thought of mangoes he wondered what made rama fix 15 annas for 10 mangoes what kind of a man was rama probably he was like shankar somehow one couldn't help feeling that he must have been like shankar with his 10 mangoes and his iron determination to get 15 annas here swaminathan felt an unaccountable sympathy for krishna unaccountable is impossible to explain so he started to think about the mangoes and his mouth started to water then he wondered about rama that what made drama to fix 15 annas for only 10 mangoes what kind of a man was this rama then he compared rama to his friend shankar and he thought that he might be rama might be like shankar with his 10 mangoes and his iron determination and a very strong determination to get 15 annas and he felt sympathetic and he felt sorry for krishna also who wants to buy only four mangoes have you done the sum father asked looking over the newspaper he was reading father 
will you tell me if the mangoes were ripe so father was reading the newspaper and he asked swami nathan that have you done the sum then he started to ask to father that father can you please tell me whether the mangoes were ripe or not father regarded him for a while and a smod and smothering a smile remarked do the sum first i will tell you whether the fruits were ripe or not afterwards so smothering here is trying hard to hide father looked at him for a while and he started to hide his smile and he said to swami that first you do the sum afterwards i am going to tell whether the mangoes were ripe or not